you guys and welcome back to half Bay Care Reviews. So today I'm going to be reviewing one of the new units that just came out. It's from Sensational. It's called the Zen Mermaid Galaxy. Um, I really like this uh, this line just because it seems like they went different and went with some crazy colors which I never really do so I figured I'd try something different because I'm sure there are other people out there that kind of wanted to see what the colors were looking like. So this is what the stock card looks like. And I got it in the color Mermaid Galaxy. So this just has one spot for the parting and it says ear to ear lace with baby hair. So I'm going to unbox it and we'll see what it's looking like. So this comes with a card that basically just shows you all the different colors they have. Like I said, I got it in the color Hidden Mermaid Galaxy. This is what the card with all the colors looks like. Which is pretty cool because it gives you an idea of the way that the colors blend together. So straight out of the box, this is what it looks like. And I really love this color a lot. It's completely different. It's really long. And I really like this fishtail breed that they have going on. Comes with baby hairs all around. So it's looking like a side parting. It has two combs that are literally right at the parting. A comb in the back and standard adjustable straps. Yeah, so I'm excited to try this one. Let's pop it on and see what it looks like. So with the lace still on, this is what it looks like. It's pretty long. My belly button is right here. This comes to like my hips. I really like this color combination a lot. Sorry if the colors of class and I try to still keep on my black uh, cardigan so you can see. I'm just going to cut this off and see what we can do with it. Okay, so I changed the shirt so you guys can hopefully get a better idea of what it's looking like. Sorry if it's a little see-through, but this is what it looks like with the lace off. And as you can see, this is definitely big head friendly because I have the straps on the tightest setting which means I have them literally linked together and it's still like there's still a little bit of space and this is definitely a unit you would have to glue down because these flaps like I mean you could bobby pin it but these flaps are just not going to be looking cute for you so I may actually just bobby pin it since um just simply doing this for the review of it and not wearing it out just yet. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Okay, you guys, so that was a lot of work. It took me forever. I didn't wrap it or anything. I just ended up bobby pinning and using got to be glue to try to stick the sides down. They're still kind of popping up, but um, just for the sake of the video, I was trying to make it look as flat as I possibly can. But I do think if you use got to be glued in a satin wrap and held it down for a little while, that you'd be set. 
but um, definitely beware that the tabs are kind of crazy on this one so you most likely will need to hold it down unless you have a larger size head you may not need to but um, at least for me it definitely seems like it was some work to get it to hold down okay you guys so I was gonna quit on this one since all this freaking flap action that's going on and I didn't want to take the braid out but I figured um might as well just take it out and see if it's salvageable with uh, the braid out maybe so let's see how this goes look at this it's pretty tangly I haven't even worn this bad boy outside and mm -mm. so say bye bye to the braid I'm hoping this doesn't some sort of justice because as of right now I'm not feeling it Because I was hoping taking it out will help mask this whole flappy situation. Yeah, so at least when you do take it out, <laughs> Jesus, that is I mean, some heavy duty tangling and shedding. Um, at least when you do take it out, definitely seems like you can mask that whole flap situation, which is good. So I didn't want it to be an entire waste. I don't know, I guess I do like it better since you can uh, see all that craziness now. I feel like I belong underwater somewhere. Yeah, so I mean, it's not bad now. Um, I guess I would change my mind. I went from kind of hating it to, I think this is cute. It's different. Um, and at least it masks that craziness going on. As you can see, there's definite tangling. Definite shedding. Um, I don't know, I kind of like this boho vibe of, of the two different patterns that are going on. It definitely does give that a... Uh, mermaid vibe this is everything to the front and the good part about it too is when you take them out it gets thicker um because one of my downsides for this was definitely the thinness of it but um taking the braids out definitely gives it way gives it way more fuller which i like a lot and i feel like the more i mess with it i kind of like it even more so i feel like i like it like this much better than the original style but i do like what they were going for with it Just to the side and then everything to the back So I'm actually surprised. Um, I normally don't take them out if it comes uh, like braided like that, but I figured it was worth it to um, not miss out on something. Because um, I was definitely ready to just like put it in the back, throw it in the back of the closet, and not look at it again. But after this, I feel like I could wear it outside and not be looking too crazy. Yeah. So now that's all I have to say about this one. Um, I definitely do think it's worth it. Look at the parted space. The baby he is, the color, the curl pattern. Normally I would think two different curl patterns together um, would look crazy, but I don't know. I just feel like because the colors and everything, it, it makes it go together. So I don't know. I like it. Yeah, but that's pretty much all I have to say. So thanks for checking this video out. Well, hope to see you again. Bye.